the threat of rain in capital city Kingston could not deter the large turnout at the Simply Myrna concert on the lawns of Devon House. Featuring in concert Jamaica's jazz songstress Dr. Myrna Haig, along with reggae star Richie Stevens and a pianist and singer Harold Davis. Myrna Haig is one of the names that pops up and the more prominent name. What sustains your dominance in jazz music throughout these years? Commitment. Even with Commitment. I'm committed to it. And it's, it's what I have loved since I was a teenager. It was my choice, you know. Um, it was, I heard the great jazz singers playing on radio and um, they were people of color. And so I identified with that. And so I'm just committed to it. It's, it's, it's the, I would call it the classical music of the people of color. The minute you walked in the joint, I could see you were a man of distinction, a real big spender, good looking, so fine. Oh, my love, my love. Our music landscape, when you think about having a career, especially in Jamaican music, persons usually think of becoming a DJ. What advice do you have for persons who wish to become a pianist and a singer like yourself? No, well, well, listen, the landscape is not just Jamaica. That's the first thing. Eh? Um, the world uh, appreciates our music and appreciates our talent, perhaps sometimes even better than we do. You know? So if it is that you're a good pianist or a good instrument player, or, you know, Go with it, go with it, because there is room in the marketplace for it. And if you do it well enough and if you're passionate about it and decide to put in the work necessary to make sure that you get to the audience and get to them with a high quality product, then go for it. Everybody! Ever since you went away, every day is just a cloudy day. And I don't know. If it's rain from the sky, tears on my eyes, falling on my face, and the road down my cheek. What's your secret? Uh, well, to be honest with you, I love being on stage. I love to entertain people. And when I'm on stage, my ultimate goal is to try and make people happy. You know, so if it takes some jumping, some smooth singing, some high energy singing, that's what I'm going to do. So this evening was a nice seated crowd and in order to get to them you have to kind of lift things up to get them up because they are already relaxed. So you don't want to just come and sing relaxing music. You know, so that is kind of how I, I, I do things. Can't turn the music down, gotta turn the beat around. Should we expect a seventh staging of Simply Murder? I think so. I think so. Because um, when we announced that we were going to, you know, five years and we thought, you know, we, are, we, don't, we didn't want people to be bored with us. And then, you know, the feedback was, no, you can't do that. <laughs> So we said, okay, well, let's try a different venue and see if we can just add something more, some punch, to just make it more interesting. Because since you have the faithful fans, we really wanted to just give them something more. So that's why we pushed out the boat a little bit this year. And that was the Simply Myrna show for 2016. Scintillating performances, energy, soulful ballads, and jazz music at its finest. I'm Candice Ming.